The Furacea FEI Nations Cup Series stayed in the sun as the opening round of the North and Central American and Caribbean League dawned here in Ocala, Florida. Going into the second round, Mexico, Colombia and the United States of America held the top three spots, but the USA, with four riders all from inside the world's top 50, looked imperious coming forward on a zero score. And then things started to develop, as they so often do in Nations Cup jumping. Mexico's Santiago Lambre came in riding the anchor leg and scored just four faults. Then for Colombia, Roberto Terran. He could afford one, but not two. Eight faults for Roberto Terran, dropping Colombia into third spot. The United States of America then pinned all their hopes onto BZ Madden. She had two fences in hand with her upcoming horse, Breitling LS, and she turned in an equitation round just over the time allowed for one fault, but it was enough. The United States of America winning convincingly on 13 faults on home soil and equaling Canada now with six wins at the Florida North American Nations Cup. The Furacea FEI Nations Cup League here in North and Central America and the Caribbean moves on to Mexico in April and concludes in Langley in British Columbia and Canada in June. And at the moment, the United States of America and Mexico hold the whip hand for the two qualifying places to the Furacea FEI Nations Cup finals in Barcelona in September this year.